Hi everyone, welcome back to my cross stitch channel. My name is Leslie and I make videos in Russian and English and it's all about cross stitching. Today I want to show you my first finished project of this year and I want to say, uh, I want to just say I'm sorry for my hands because me and my husband we like to make uh, different kinds of juices. We juice our own vegetables and fruit and yesterday we made um, juice from pomegranates and I have to peel all of them and my fingers got dirty and I can't get it out so I'm sorry about that so please ignore it and I'll show you where I took the project from this was from um, cross stitch magazine great from Great Britain this is cross stitch gold by June 2018 and this is the beautiful lady summer lady that I've cross stitched this is the preview and now I'll show you my finished project just a moment This is what it looks like. I think she's beautiful. Uh, I It took me about three and a half weeks to finish this project. And the finished project, the size is eight by nine inches. And the instruction reads that I should take uh, or use um, uh, even, even weave um, material, but I don't like it. I like Ada fabric, so I took 16 count Ada fabric. And I um, most of the most of this is in crosses. This is made by half a cross stitch. The bushes are but with just half a cross stitch. There's a lot of back stitching. You have back stitching on her mm, clothes, or her face, arm, her hand, and uh, her jewelry, and all of these uh, butterflies and um, all these flowers have back stitching. Uh, I stitched with uh, two strands of floss. And I'll show you the floss that I used. I had to buy a lot of DMC floss. Two cards, two project cards here. And uh, there's about a total of 35 colors. And I have to buy all of them separately because this is not a kit. And it cost a lot, of course. But uh, I'm still pleased with the result and um, have a lot of DMC floss left and I'm not going to throw it away. I'm going to save it and use it for other future projects. And one day I'll show you how I store my floss and what I do with the leftover floss and how I store it and keep it. Um, I did like to cross stitch it. It was not so extremely difficult. There are there are some things that I I don't understand in, in the chart like like for example here you have, you have her right shoulder and her left shoulder. Here you have the sun that is shining on her right shoulder, so it's a little bit um, brighter. And this has maybe a little bit of a shadow in it. And I understand why it's darker, but I just think it's the difference between the two shoulders is way too big. It should have been more, more brighter, even though it's a shadow effect here. And there's too much, uh, the shadow here from her, um, from her hat is way too strong, maybe too dark here on her face and her arm and her, and under her chin. I just wish it was a, a little bit uh, brighter, not as dark, even though I understand what the, it was Maria, I think it was Maria Diaz, uh, who designed this chart. I understand, I understand what she meant, but it's, I think it's still too dark. And then I don't understand why Correct, please correct me if I'm wrong, but usually the sky usually is blue, whereas the the clouds are are white. Whereas here, I think this is the sky is white and the clouds are blue. I don't. I think that's wrong, but correct me if I'm wrong, and just let me know in the comment section if that is if you think that is okay. But this is what it looks like. And I'm pleased with it. I'm going to use this as a cover photo for my YouTube channel, Cross Stitch Lady. So this is the Cross Stitch Lady. Um, I think that uh, next time I'm going to make, uh, I'm going to take a, a cross stitch kit because I've been cross stitching a lot, of, a lot from magazines. I'm getting tired of it. So my next project is going to be a cross stitch kit. And I'm going to be doing a uh, reviewing all the cross stitch kits that I'm going to be starting. So the next video is probably going to be about a cross stitch kit that I'm going to be uh, starting. 
so that's about it so let me know in the comment section below what you think about this project do you like her <laughs> or not uh, and i hope you have a great day and a great week uh, and like comment and subscribe because there's so much more to come and i'll see you in my next video have a great day bye bye